Now you're going to die. What is up YouTube, it's DC5 Rapich here and today I'm bringing you a MOAB on the map underground which, I don't know, I was just mucking around by myself playing some lonesome um, kill confirmed and yeah I ended up picking up a MOAB so um, basically I don't want to talk too much about the gameplay today, I'll talk a bit about it when um, I see something neat or whatever but um, yeah I pretty much just want to talk about what I have in mind for my channel right so one of my subscribers sent me a message saying hey why don't you like um, do something like put one of our gameplays up and tell us where we went wrong and stuff so that is a very good idea and I'm thinking about doing that if you guys would like to see that uh, leave a comment down below if you guys would like to see something like that because um you know I can pick up one of your gameplays where you don't do too well too well like I don't know it's a like a decent gameplay but you know you made some mistakes and um, if you'd like me to try and uh, teach you guys how to get better that way like that's just the sort of good idea that I don't know that we can try and work through I can help you guys and you can have one of your gameplays up like it might not be your best gameplay but you know we can go through it break it down where you guys went wrong or whatever and um yeah try and help you guys get Moabs and stuff like that because I know all you guys are excited to, for Moabs me personally I'm kind of over Moabs you know I don't really go for them too much anymore sometimes I just whack on specialists because I don't know just if I'm in a shitty lobby where people are just really crap I'll just whack it on see if I can get one or whatever which is basically what you gotta do if you, in order for you to have fun with this game. So, basically, when I have fun with this game, I like to just, you know, rack up all those kills, just beast on these bitches, and I don't know, just outplay people. So, yeah, about this gameplay anyway. This is a flawless Moab uh, on underground. I'm using the PP90. Um, I've got to start switching up these guns, guys. I don't know. I'm, I'm just getting sick of them. What guns would you guys like to see as well? I'd like. Look at that a knife. I never get knives. But anyway, what guns would you guys like to see me um, get a gameplay with? Like, it doesn't have to be a MOAB or anything. I'll just get like like maybe a high killer, high scoring game, action packed. Maybe give you guys a few tips on how to use the gun. If there's any ridiculous gun that you want want me to use? Like, I don't know. I'm really shitty with the sniper rifles, so I don't know. Like, uh, if I you guys requested a sniper rifle like an MSR or a Dragunov su suppressed or something, you know, don't expect a huge like huge score, but you know, I, I can try and do my best. Um, yeah, because, I don't know, it's... To be honest, when you're not using the PP90, um, the P90, or the MP7, and, I don't know, just guns like that, the SCAR or the ACR, it's just, I don't know, everyone else is using it, so you kind of feel like you're at a disadvantage because those guns are... I wouldn't say they're overpowered. I'd say that they are more predominant. Like, a lot of people use them. Maybe they're easier to use weapons. Some have faster, faster uh, rate per fire, rate of fire. Um, maybe if they've got a larger mag or whatever. But yeah, they're pr probably the most predominant guns in the game. What, what what do you guys reckon are the most? What's the most overpowered gun in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3? Now, excuse the FMG nines because we all know they're like absolutely nuts. Excuse the FMG nines and maybe the Striker. What is what is the best? Uh, Alright, let's leave it as submachine gun. What's the best submachine gun? The overpowered one. The one that anyone can just pick up and do well with. So, I want you guys to leave that in the comment section down below as well. Uh, don't forget about uh, if you guys would like to see one of your gameplays and me breaking it down, commentating over it, maybe pausing it once in a while, see where you go wrong, and just break it down that way. That might be a new series that you guys might like to enjoy. and. I know you could have like a little shout out or whatever because your your video is on, on, I don't know, it's on the YouTube. You can show your grandma and she can see you beasting on all these bitches, teabagging noobs. And then you might get done up by um, some guy with Last Stand or something, I don't know. There's <laughs> not much ways you can get around Last Stand. I had my rant last episode. If you guys haven't seen that, um, definitely go check out my latest video. Um, yeah, what else would I like to talk about? Um, I'd like to talk about the FMG9s. Okay, so the FMG9s, they are absolutely nuts. But, have you guys ever tried the Dual Wield Scorpions? They have no recoil. The FMG9s have so much recoil. The only reason why everyone uses the FMG9s, in my opinion, in my opinion, if you choose to accept my opinion or not, is that, um, the FMG9s have a faster rate of fire, which drops people pretty much quicker, and um, 
drops people quicker. I reckon it's got a larger clip than like the Scorpions, but the Scorpions have no recoil. Now, if you get up close and personal with against the Scorpions and FMG9s, the FMG9s are probably going to win because they just shoot so much faster and there's so much more ammo in the clip. Now, that's why I reckon FMG9s are a bit more overpowered than any other secondary. Like, I don't know, you guys, someone complained that um, I was using the FMG9s, but, you know, what are you going to do? Like, everyone else uses them. you got to play on their level until they patch them to the point where you can't use them, which, which maybe they might do, but knowing Infinity Ward, they probably won't because they said they already patched it and <laughs> they haven't really done much about it. But, yeah, I don't know. What are your guys' opinions on the FMG9? What is the predominant overpowered uh, SMG that you guys think and would you like to see that episode that I was talking about so they're just the things I'd like you guys to answer in the comments I read all your comments guys I try to reply to them you guys might know see I'm not one of those guys they're just gonna snog everyone off but yeah that's pretty much it that's all I want to talk about this commentary I hope you guys enjoyed this flawless gameplay I don't know it's using the PP90 you know it's not not that hard to get a gameplay with this gun but you know just beasting it up tearing shit up Terran noobs new ones and yeah anyway guys uh, if you haven't subscribed subscribe already leave a rating if you enjoyed it and I'll catch all you guys later peace